we can't thank you enough for taking us on short notice. We honestly didn't know where to turn. Mom died last week. It was so sudden. There were so many things Klob didn't get to say to her. But he, he's Klob. Um, I'm Klob. Yeah, you know, that's why we thought we'd try a seance, even though I always thought that those kind of things were... Phony? Yes. 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 She is good. Klob knew it! Gentlemen, I, the great medium, Madame Madeline, have been doing this for 25 years. And while it is unusual to speak with the dead, I assure you, there is nothing insincere about it. No, I, 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 I believe you. It all looks and smells very professional. Excellent. So tell me, what was your mother's name? Florence. Florence? Florence. Oh, that's a lovely name. I believe it means freshly prepared papaya in Hebrew. Wow. I, I never knew. Klob knew. Klob too afraid to say. Okay, shh. Klob go shh. I'm seeing a hamster. And just to let you know, um, the seance hasn't begun yet. Uh, just showing a little bit about my personal life. I'm dating a hamster. His name is Ziggy. Let us begin the seance as we contact the afterworld and summon the spirit of Florence, the very, very dead mother of club and what your name? Balt. So Walt. Balt. Balt? Balt. Ba Balt. Okay. It, names matter not, dear child. A rose by any other name would be still as sweet. What matters is that your mother is very, very dead. And now we shall talk with her. Her aura is approaching me. And who? Oh, what's this? I'm seeing a hamster, and this is not the hamster I'm dating, mind you. This is an entirely separate, very attractive, downright debonair, second hamster. Okay, there's a strong connection here with the second hamster. Uh, please tell me, uh, did your mother love hamsters? No. For a pet, did your mother ever have a hamster? Did you two ever have a pet hamster? No. Have you ever touched a hamster? Hmm. Have you ever seen, whether in the wild or domesticated, a hamster? Have you heard of hamsters? Uh, yeah, Clubbers. everybody has. Everybody has yeah. Ah, yes. There's the connection. Okay, this second hamster, this cutie pie, has a definite role in this seance. And it appears to be that of a spiritual gatekeeper. In other words, we cannot speak to your very dead mother unless we speak through him. Is it even possible? Well, it won't be easy, but I can try. Now, what should we ask her? I, I just wanted to know how much we miss her. Is she at peace? Mom, what number am I thinking of? Is she in heaven? What's that movie where they're fighting the wars and they're flying around in the stars? Can she, can she forgive us? What is cabbage? Oh yeah, that one too. Yeah, what is cabbage? Oh great and pretty hot hamster deity. We seek passage to speak to the very dead Florence. Please tell us, is she at peace? Uh, 
What does it all mean? We don't, we don't speak hamster. Ah, yes. Well, this is most unfortunate. But there is one other way we can speak to your totally dead mother. It does involve a great deal of concentration. Whatever it is, we'll do it. Club does have his limits. We must chant a holy incantation in perfect unison. It must be done without error and with total sincerity. We'll do it for mom. So let's join hands and now repeat after me. <sighs> on you and squeeze on you and make sexy time tonight. Uh, what was that? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm just sending a voice text to the hamster. The first one I told you about, the one I'm dating, Ziggy. Uh. And now hi, the great medium, Madame Madeline, have contacted your very dead mother, Florence. She says she is at peace. She is surrounded by the spirits and auras of her loved ones. And she has these words of wisdom for you. Fret not on the path of life. Let your troubles cascade off your impenetrable souls. And above all else, take joy in the little things in life. The furry, sexy, Attractive, cheek-stuffing, bosom-burrowing, little things in life. Get stop, 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 I never knew. Bob knew. Bob too afraid to say. I will do it. Bony. A little fake. And what's this? I'm seeing a hamster. All I wanna do. Take 
Vermont. Z. You want to try something a little different? Here you go. Your approach? Not as uh, yeah, not as much of a lobotomy experience. I'm what's this? I'm sick. And uh, what's this? I'm seeing a hatch. <laughs> Distinctive. Debonair. Hamster. <laughs> Dare I say debonair hamster? <laughs> okay, let's say <laughs> debonair hamster. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> I assure you, there is nothing insincere about it. <laughs> this is fucking dumb. <laughs> it's working, it's working for me. 